to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. We are back at Duncan today, first time in a little bit, but they have brought back their fall menu, folks. So, we're here to try their new beverages. I'm doing two separate reviews. I like to kind of put things together, like if there's food and drink, then I love to put those together, but there's no new food. Their pumpkin bakery lineup is back. Their uh, maple bacon sandwich is back. So nothing new in the food department, but two new drinks, doing two separate reviews. So hopefully you enjoy this. Uh, the blood orange is coming tomorrow. The review for that, it is out now. So uh, if, if you don't watch that review, I'm sorry. You know that you found somebody else that you could watch. My heart is broken. But if you would like to watch that video tomorrow, if you hit that subscribe button, that should help you out. So what is the Nutty Pumpkin? Well, the Nutty Pumpkin is their, um, you know, their coffee. And I'm sorry about if you can hear the, all the emergency uh, signals in the background. But anyways, it's their coffee. And you get hot or iced. And you get pumpkin syrup mix and a shot of good old good old hazelnut so yeah it's a mix of hazelnut and pumpkin also as a reminder if you liked last year's halloween menu that will be coming back uh later of course you know this is a lot of stuff that they have to work with to begin with so let them kind of catch up on that and then you know that stuff's going to come back i loved the peanut butter macchiato um, maybe you want to go watch that video too, but I recommend that when it comes back. But right while we don't have that, I think this is going to be interesting. So let's try it. Hmm. It's very interesting. It actually pairs kind of well. Like from that nutty flavor of the hazelnut. And then you've got the, the the spiced flavored pumpkin flavor in there, you know? Now, when I think about my hazelnut, I think about something that's kind of close to chocolate. But I'm always thinking, okay, I'm looking at Nutella. I'm thinking about Nutella mix. But that's not what hazelnut is particularly going to be. Um, a lot of times it's just more of the nutty side of it rather than the um, grinded down sugared up version so that's something to kind of think about when drinking this it's not particularly going to be like this chocolatey drink it's a nutty pumpkin as it says it's very good And you know what, hazelnut kind of just, it adds that kind of flavor that you would get with, you know, non-dairy milks. But you still get the milkiness of it. So you still get milk in here. You still get a nutty flavor that's really intriguing. And then you get a nice burst of pumpkin. Sure, it's not the strongest burst of pumpkin. And I have always said that I prefer Starbucks over everybody else's pumpkin spice. But I still think it's it it's nice. And it's not overly sweet. Like, it is sweet, but I've had worse. I've had, you know, just crazier sugary drinks from Duncan. I thoroughly enjoy this. It's really straightforward. Not overly simple, because you got two different kind of flavor profiles. But it's very intriguing. Um... Would I say it's the best coffee I've ever had? No, but I think it's really, really good. So for that, I'm going to give it an eight and a half. I think it's very solid. And, you know, if you like those kind of flavors, you're going to like this. So, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this review. Hopefully I'll see you all tomorrow. Oh, Pocky One Chip Challenge coming up um, in my next video, too. So please watch that. And I will see you all around.